All right, Jane, let's take a look at one of your runs. Welcome back on the snow. Making some good turns for a uh, comeback from a broken kneecap. Let's take a look here at regular motion first. And a little bit slower. Let's slow it down. Good stuff there. You know, the one thing I'd really want to try to work on is, um, you know, rolling both skis up on edge. You can kind of see, you know, a little bit of an A-frame there. Same kind of going on that side. You know, you can see that. So really try to bolt, roll both uh, skis up identically. We want matching angles. Uh, think about trying to drive the inside knee uh, into the turn. The outside knee will come along. So think about pushing the inside knee forward, forward and inside and get that thing up. Little toe down on the inside foot, big toe down on the outside foot or downhill foot. The other thing I'd, I'd want to work on is you know, your pole plant. You know, try not to raise the hand too much uh, and then drop it afterwards. See how it falls down? So I want to keep those hands up front as we can. Your left hand of pole plants are nearly not as kind of deliberate. It kind of, there it was behind you. Uh, your right handed ones, you're going to see it go up, plant, and then you kind of ski by it and drop the hand. So don't ski by the pole. Uh, kind of tap it, pull it out, keeping the hand out in front. Your left hand ones not as deliberate and behind you again right there and then the hand kind of drops back you can see it right there so keep the hands out in front and more deliberate or, or more you know stronger pole plants on the left hand and try to roll up both skis up on edge get rid of that, rid of that a-frame we want parallel shafts of the shins let's watch you finish off in slow-mo here Otherwise, pretty good skiing, right? Nice level shoulders. Nice clean arc on the outside ski. Just get rid of that A-frame. And we will just speed it up there. All right, good job.